All right, so we're just about to hit some games with Devin. He's coming up right now. Big thank you to Make-A-Wish for setting up and of course Xbox for providing us with everything today. Hopefully, we're gonna catch some dubs. <laughs> Thanks for picking me as your wish. Really appreciate it today. And like I said, we're gonna get some actual dogs. Yeah, okay. Right. Thank you, I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Alrighty, day number one of E3, we got a lot of check out. We've obviously got the Fortnite booth. And then at the Fortnite booth, I'm gonna be streaming slash recording uh, this brand new LTM for Fortnite, uh, Prop Hunt. So that's gonna be super exciting. Separate video for that, of course. But yeah, first things first, I think we're hitting up some chicken and waffles. So let's get it. So I'm about to jump through and do some streaming on the new prop hunt mode. Uh, they've put this box here with a bunch of skateboards. These just came out. Everyone knows I always wanted this as an actual thing and they actually made it. So, I'm taking this one out. All right, so this is my setup for streaming at the Fortnite booth. It's pretty epic. We're gonna stick a view behind us and we're gonna play a brand new unreleased uh, prop hunt game mode. So that's gonna be epic. Let's get it. Alright, so that's wrapping up day one of the Fortnite booth. We're gonna come back tomorrow with the elf outfit and do some more activities. But, uh, Fortnite booth, it's sick. Can't rate. Alright, everybody, day number two at E3. Uh, we're gonna go to the Fortnite booth once again, but today I'm gonna change things up a little bit. I'm gonna go in my elf outfit. Now, I've been working on this outfit for a while now. I haven't worn it yet. I was gonna wear it at the prime on Sunday. I still am gonna wear it on Sunday, uh, but we're about to jump into it now. And uh, yeah, we're gonna wear it today. It's gonna be great. We're gonna get sick photos and uh, it's gonna look super sick. Let's get it. There it is. The elf outfit. All right, fully kitted up, about to hit the show floor. Um, shoes aren't exactly the most comfortable. They're like weighing probably 10 kilos combined because of the 3D modeling underneath. But it should be fun. What's up? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm gonna actually. Oh, yeah. You're actually gonna be seen standing next to this guy. Made it to E3. I'm gonna go to the booth. I need a coffee though, I'm completely dead. This thing is, I feel like a penguin walking around with these shoes, man. So, all right, so back here again, trying to do the wheel. No golden ticket today, but that doesn't matter because I can't win anyway, because I'm playing. Uh, but there's still a few consoles left, and there's a lot more socks. So let's get one more socks. Spin the wind, boys. 
How many we got left? We got enough. Yeah. We got enough. All right, let's go. Game console. Not socks. Sorry, no. Not socks. No. My bad, Siri. Console. My bad, Siri. Come on, come on, stop. No, stop, stop. No, no, I want a hat. I already got a hat. I don't want socks either. Oh, give me a hat. Give me a hat. Ah, oh, so <laughs> close. I actually thought I was gonna steal one. That would have been funny. <laughs> that would have been funny. <laughs> We're like, oh, of course he gets it. Alright, so I get a hat, but I already got a hat, so... So we're leaving the YouTube lounge. We're going to E3 and we're gonna try and get uh, some more Fortnite fun. We're gonna do that little circle obstacle course thing with all the guys. And I'm also gonna try and play Fortnite on one of the accounts with all the skins. Uh, so let's get it. This is the thing about Elliot. He's not that good at the video game. You gotta be in seven minutes and... Drink the, the screen of this is freaky, isn't it? Your boy out here secured a 3 minute 40 run, so we're going to spin the wheel again. They don't have a console anymore, but they've got a game controller. You want socks? Oh, burgers. Oh, those are fresh. Right beside So just filmed a little bit of a video here, uh, showing off some of the skins that they had in game. Obviously, we got like the new exclusive Wonder skin and stuff like that. China backlings, new emotes. Uh, wasn't able to get the dub. Uh, the video's probably already up on the channel, but uh, just go check it out. All the exclusive skins and whatnot. But yeah, I think we're out of here for now. I'm just waiting for it to upload. We're out of here. All right, so we're heading out from the E3 booth to the C3 in total. We're not coming back to LA until the Saturday creative session and the Prime on Sunday. So buy a Fortnite booth. It was such an awesome booth, much better than last year. We decided to see the next year, and uh, yeah, let's get on the road. Alrighty, so we're back in LA for the Summer Block party festivities, starting things off. Day one, the Saturday, it's gonna be the Creative Cup or something like that. I'm not too sure, there's like nine or eight teams and we're competing, it's me and Cypher. Uh, Phantom, I believe is like a producer or something. And then we have a golden ticket person. So that's someone who was grinding the wheel at E3 and they've got the chance to play with us today. And if we are to win with that golden ticket person, I think they then go on to the Creative World Cup. So that's gonna be really cool. But I believe we're heading down to the lobby and going over to the venue now. This is like the retail row section. Everyone's getting like free merch, getting kitted up, and uh, picked up this like yellow and black t-shirt. Looks pretty cool. Also got this drift one. It looks sick. Super sick. All right, we're about to jump in. This is the whole squad. Get picked up. What's up, Creative Trials qualifiers? Hey, I did one of those. Five different maps were created, hosted by Scissors, Ninja, Lockleg, Tortaga, and El Rubius. That's our mascot, you're gonna lead us to victory. Oh! Oh! oh. 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 Little Whip, don't take that. We're gonna take that here. Oh my god, yes! <laughs> is the chicken getting involved too now? Yeah. Oh, is he a bull? Oh. Run, 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 run. Oh. Oh. I didn't see the business. It's okay, Little Whip. Don't worry about it. We also have to welcome another team to the stage. It's the Little Whip Warriors. You know them, so let's see them. Here they come. It's comprised of Cypher PK, Lachlan, Phantoms, the DJ uh, duo, and then obviously the gold ticket winner, Rob Corey. So, Cypher PK is one of the guys that we know. That's it. What's up? What's up, guys? 
Cheaper wired, no! Jumping into it now, this is game number one. Just had some practice. Kinda can't work. But uh, yeah, jumping into it. You already know what it is. Exclusive China backlinks for the boys. Let's get this dub. Warriors are going to be inside of the point, but they need Phantoms to get there so they can start to earn. So a halftime break, four out of six games done. Uh, we got second one game and mixed results. Getting eliminated by pro players. Feels good, man. It's just like the World Cup. Love to see it. There's like supply drops coming in from the top, and they're like fighting for it. Yo, that's going to cause a fight, dude. That's going to cause a fight. You don't get it. Oh, and there it is. Hey, she's yoinked it. Oh, no, they're like actual fighting for it, dude. Little Whip Warriors going up against Ravens Revenge. The Brazilians managing to pick up game number two. Well, that's a wrap for the Little Whip boys. Uh, I don't know what their final standing was. It was like fifth or fourth or probably sixth. Beat Latin there. Um, well, that guy couldn't really pick up the sword, so I don't really much to brag about. Second by 20 points. How does yeah. it feel? Epic. Help lock them. Little whip we needed here. Little whip weren't getting the door done. But we were like kind of shooting their team. You guys were one, and they still won. Alrighty, Epic Gamers, we are about to go off to the Fortnite Pro-Am. You already know what it is, we dressed as the elf. A little crap check for everybody out there. These shoes legit weigh like three or four kilos. I don't know, obviously I look ridiculous in this outfit, but hey, it's for a show, it's for fun. And I wear this skin on like pretty much every Fortnite video, so why not, one time. But yeah, today we got Cody Walker, uh, he's our duo. We played a couple games. It's gonna be interesting. Uh, we're gonna try and see what we can work with. Um, it is World Cup format, so it's points per elim, siphon, max uh, capped mats, and then there's also placement points. So, a lot to play for, four games total. Most points wins the Pro-Am, all that kind of fun stuff. Let's head into the lobby and see what everybody thinks about my fit. Why do you look like an idiot? Yeah. You know what, Elliot? You don't, and that means you look like a girl. Just said there's no siphon. So we're about to jump in with group number two. We got this in the bag. Oh, also random skins, so no elf skin today, but that's fine. Alright, me and Cody about to get the stage. You get it. Yeah, here we go. And Lachlan and Cody Walker, they look like they're having all kinds of fun, Bala. Yeah, absolutely. We know there's tons of Lachlan fans, and he's doing it again. The signature code name Elf Disguise is on. Awesome. Let's get it. Look at this. Uh, look at all the people. <laughs> the whole lobby's here. Uh, whatever happens, happens. Here we go. Now, Lachlan, if you were watching the elimination feed, he just picked up Pokemon. She has been eliminated. Lachlan, code name Elf, code name Locky here. He's hungry for He sees the player running there. A few great shots. They're on very low HP, and there you go. Mark Doherty is picked up as well. All right, we just got done with game number two. Currently fourth, which is a pretty big deal. Back-to-back uh, -back 10 point games. A lot of lucky, lucky rips, lucky bowls. We're gonna keep playing bowlers for placement. Let's see how we go. Okay. Don't forget, guys. Lachlan loves to rock that code elfin. Known for rocking it in game as well. This is part of that staple brand. I mean, literally, he's like wearing it. You know. He's quite literally wearing it. <laughs> he's owning it. He even has the blonde hair to go, guys. This is this is serious commitment here. I'm pretty sure that's <laughs> not a wig. I think that's his. Hey, man. Top ten in the pro am. Hey, so sweaty. We did. 